Today is Thursday, October 24th, and you're watching an SCW News Digest. Tonight, Stockton police officers are asking for the public's help in finding the suspects in a home burglary. According to police, the unknown man wearing the red shirt in this photo burglarized a home on the 3200 block of Swain Road. According to officials, he and the woman pictured in the black tank top then used the victim's stolen credit cards at various businesses. Anyone who, who recognizes who the suspects are is asked to call the Stockton Police Department. Well, two juveniles have been cited in connection with a fire that damaged Lodi's historic Zupo baseball field. As we have reported, a fire broke out at Zupo Field in September. The Lodi field was a site of history for many locals and bordered the Great Bowl. Recently, police released surveillance camera video showing two juvenile uh, suspects near the scene of the fire when it broke out. Lodi police were able to find those two 12-year-olds soon after and question and ultimately cite them. Lodi police do not believe that there are any outstanding suspects. We'll be right back after this break. Here you go. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome back. Some good news tonight for area student chefs through a generous donation. The San Joaquin Stanislaus Cattle Women, San Joaquin Chapter of California Women for Agriculture, and San Joaquin Farm Bureau Federation all came together to collect and donate 500 pounds of ingredients like cheese, pumpkins, walnuts, and beef to 2,725 students in six local school districts. The donations are being distributed by the San Joaquin County Office of Education with three pickups organized for the various districts. Thank you for watching this SCW News Digest. I'll see you back here tomorrow with more news from Stockton.